If there's a nuclear explosion, okay. you might think it would be best to oh, hide inside no. a refrigerator to protect yourself. Only if your survival plan comes from an Indiana Jones movie. A refrigerator is not PPE. Not to defend against a 400 plus kiloton fireball and supersonic shock front. But let's see what really happens. The fridge okay. can offer a lot of protection from the initial heat and radiation no, not even a little bit. A typical fridge wall is about half a millimeter steel skin. And even if it was lead, that wouldn't change anything. Basically a soda can with aspirations. Radiation protection requires mass density and thickness. Think meters of concrete or or water. And the heat, the fridge won't block it. It'll flash char, deform, rupture, and crush you. And that's assuming you're outside of the range of the fireball. The explosion. But if you are even five miles near the explosion, the blast force would be too powerful and throw you away. If you're out in the open, five miles, depending on the yield of the weapon, is actually far enough that if you're indoors, you're probably going to be okay. Just keep away from windows and stay inside for at least three days to prevent exposure. And there's a 9.3% chance you'll survive that. What kind of thin air did he pull that number from? Again, you're better off just being indoors. Your survival rate at five miles is going to be way greater than that. The fridge would lower your odds. At that distance, the fridge only helps if your goal is death by head trauma in an appliance. 